Hey guys, I am doing a skincare routine video, even though I think it got voted no on my Twitter, but I was going to do it anyways. I just like holding polls. <laughs> Actually, I'm going to check and see what it's at. Well, I looked on Twitter and it was 40% yes, 60% no. But I'm going to have to do it anyways because, <laughs> I don't know, I feel like I could help people because I did clear up all my acne. Not all. I mean, I still do get acne because I'm a teenager and a girl on top of that and it's close to that time of the month so you know I'm gonna get acne. Um, my skin type, just for everyone who's wondering, <coughs> because I know people want to know so that they'll know how these products will work for them. I am oily. I'm not, I don't really have sensitive skin but I have a freckles here. I'll zoom in a little bit. Get ready very red skin like I'm just naturally have red skin I've just like had breakouts right here I don't know why I have this black head right here I don't know how to get rid of it it's like a little bump it won't go away yep. I'm not wearing any makeup I thought you know if I'm doing a skincare routine why wear makeup so you know you guys can see what my face looks like without makeup and what my skin really looks like so I do have very oily skin like around here and my t-zone now my chin a little bit I don't know like I don't know how to get rid of it like I don't know what to do <laughs> some of these things might be not help like I've always had oily skin like it's not anything new it's just always been one of those things so uh, I'm gonna show you guys like what I use I like my nightly routine and like spot treatment uh, I don't really use face masks, but um, I'll get more into that. I'm going to show you like the products that I use first. So, um, every, like when I wash my face and whatever, shower, whatever, I use, this is empty. This is an empty one. I have a full one. Um, this actually comes in a set. Actually comes in a set. This is um, the acne free oil. The acne free, oil free acne cleanser. This is the face wash I use. It is to buy this bottle itself. It is $5.22 at Walmart. I just googled and then I picked one of the prices. So there's this. And then after that, now this comes in a set like this. This has th these two things have a mini face wash that comes with it, but I seem to go through the face wash quicker than I go through these things, which I forgot to Google how much these things are, like it comes in a set, so I'm going to cool that real quick, and I'll tell you guys what it is. So at Walmart to get the set with these two things, and then the little face wash, which I don't know where that is, I do know I have a full one, I think it might be in luggage, I don't even know, I think it's like in my set where I have like conditioner and shampoo and whatever. But this is sixteen seventeen at Walmart. I think I just said that. So uh, after I do my face wash, I then use the acne free renewing toner, which is step two of this. And this like I feel like this like set right here really helps clear up my acne. Um, and you know it's just a liquid toner. I feel like all toners are liquid. Um, this has benzoyl peroxide in. I'm pretty sure. Let's say this has advanced micro benzoyl peroxide, which is what helps clear up acne. Just saying, and I just put it on with um, these textured cotton rounds. You can just use the uh, cotton ball or whatever. You just, just whatever, put it on. <laughs> so I use that. And then, and then after that, I use the repair lotion, which is the last step in that um, three pack. And it is, oh, they have little, okay, this is skin balancing formula, it says, and this says continuous release benzoyl peroxide. So you just put on a little bit of this. This is like, as it says, a lotion. It's kind of like a very liquidy lotion. Um, 
So I wouldn't recommend using this if you have sensitive skin because it has benzoyl peroxide and I feel like that's going to be very abrasive on your skin and it's going to just cause more problems than needed. I know they have also, by this brand, they have a severe acne one that's like in orange bottles. I did have that one time, but I think it expired because my mom had it. She told me to use it and then my face like... Either I was allergic to or it was just, I think it was just old. So there's that. But, <clears throat> that's like, these are the first steps I used this with. It's pretty much all I was using at first. And then there's another, um, I basically just use whatever moisturizer I have. But one that I no knew, noticed that had helped with my oil a little bit, which I ran out of, so I wasn't going to put it in this video at first. But it's the Clean and Clear Advantage Acne Control Control Moisturizer Oil Free. Um, I'll look up how much this is. It's only showing me on Jet.com. That's six seventy eight. They have one. There's a different one that's at Target for four ninety nine. Um, but this one, the Advantage one. So on Clean and Clear themselves, their own website. I don't think there's like any left. Wow, there's some in here. Maybe I'll use that. It's because it's upside down. Anyway, so this is oil free. Okay, let me look up how much it is on Walmart because it's giving me a link. So this is oil free. It helps treat and prevent acne. It has salicylic acid on in it. Okay, so it's five sixty four for this. Anyway, so salicylic acid and benzoyl peroxide are really good for acne so there's that <clears throat> so this is what I used to use and then I was like I have so many moisturizers I need to start using them up so I was just doing that okay and then after I do all that I then put on my oils which I have this jojoba oil which has actual oil all over it mm -hmm. Okay, so this is by the brand Measurable Difference, and I actually got this at TJ Maxx for $6. I just grabbed, uh, I was trying to find jojoba oil, and then the other two oils, you'll see what they are. But, um, this is by Measurable Differences, and if you want to buy this specific one, and if you can't find it at TJ Maxx or whatever, this is $7.41 at Walmart, this exact bottle and everything. So, that's where you can get this. I put this on... Usually I put a few drops on, and then go in with my two other moist or two other oils and put them on, and then I rub them in. So there's this. This is a four ounce bottle, so it's quite a bit. And if you go, I recommend going to TJ Maxx for skincare stuff, especially oils, because they always have oils. So and then the next oil that I use in the same kind of bottle is also by Measurable Difference. This is vitamin E oil. I'm pretty sure I can use this on my face. I, I googled it. I knew I hope the oil is good for oily skin. I don't know about vitamin E. I do this at night because I'm not going to do this before makeup because I'm definitely going to be oily. So this is vitamin E, also $6. But they don't have this one on Walmart anymore because I tried to find it. Because if they had this one, I was pretty sure they were going to have this one. Buy the same brand, everything. Uh, you can buy it on Amazon for $9.99. So... Four, four ounces. Tell me if this I can put on my face. I feel like it can because it's it says face and body moisturizer. So okay, and then the last oil I put on my face is the Clear Fresher Younger Clarifying Tea Tree Beauty Oil by Skin Solve. I also got this for I think six dollars at TJ Maxx. Except the only thing I don't like about this is that it's a pump and it's not droppers usually I just open this up and like drop some because the pump sucks and it sprays it everywhere it is literally the the least effective pump ever so I just put this all over my face because I hear that it helps with acne so usually I try to like target these areas right here with it so there's that and um this to, if you want to get it online, is $15.99 on Amazon, which 
again, you don't have to get this exact one. I'd recommend going to TJ Maxx. I know Emily Lee, she got her tea tree oil at TJ Maxx for also $6, and hers works really well. So just go to TJ Maxx. I recommend for oils. If you really have to go online, maybe look at Walmart for them, but TJ Maxx is where to go. <laughs> Right, and then after that, so after like 10 to 15 minutes, I then go in with moisturizer. This is just moisturizer that I'm using right now. But like I said, I'd rather be using this one. I just I forgot to buy it when I went and bought moisturizer. And I don't really, I only have like little sample packs and, you know. Alright, so this is the Garnier Skin Active Moisture Rescue Freshing Gel Cream. It's for a normal to combo skin. I was in Walmart one day. What was the best, um... I have hiccups, I'm sorry. <laughs> I googled what was the best moisturizers for oily skin. And this is like the second one. Oh, there's something in my eye, I'm sorry. The second cheapest or whatever. Um, but there's this. Oh, and I, back to these. Real quick, I'll tell you the price of this in a second. Back to it, these things. <laughs> there's another set by this French brand. I, I know what it is called. F a seller or F a, I don't know, but I used their moisturizer or not their moisturizer. Their face wash wasn't really helping me, but they do have another set, ooh, another set like these. Except it's more expensive and you get less product. I was actually gonna buy that one, and then I was like, no, these are cheaper and you get more. And I was like, we'll see if it works. If it doesn't, then we try the other one. And these actually worked really well. Like it really helped. So anyway, so here's some moisturizer if you want to buy it. It's six twenty nine at Target, and as you can see, it's just a gel formula. I feel like I'd pay way more for this at Walmart. I feel like it's pretty expensive. No, I was gonna get the Neutrogena one. Neutrogena one. It was like sixteen dollars, and I was like, I can do that. But so there's this. Um, it's just a moisturizer. I don't really know what to say because it's just you know. Smells well, nice. It just kind of feels cooling on your face too. If you like that, then there's that. But again, I feel like the other moisturizer works better for me. So after this runs out, I'm going to go buy that one again if I can find it anywhere. I mean at Walmart again, so there's that. Alright, so that's everything that I do after I wash my face. Now, in the morning before school, I don't wash my face because I have more time for that and I don't want to go through all of this before that. So in the morning before school, what I do is I take this and a cotton round. This is the L'Oreal Hydra Fresh Toner. Um, it's alcohol free. There's that. Um, I think it smells like roses. Kind of, oh, kind of smells like roses. So I put. I dropped the lid. Please hold. Okay, it smells like roses. If you don't like that, then whatever. I just use this. Because it's like, it's. I feel like it's not as abrasive as this one. And this one, I just use it to, like, get the oil and dirt off my face before I do my makeup. It's basically just any extra makeup, whatever. I use this to take off. I was using this micellar water by Simple. I don't use it anymore. I forgot why I switched. I think I just wanted to try and see if this would work better because my pores were big so I was like, I think a toner would be better. So I used this. This is $6.99 at Ulta. Um, pretty sure it's cheaper at Walmart. Walmart probably is cheaper for most of the stuff if you can get it at Walmart. Like this stuff, definitely get at Walmart. It's cheaper. Um, so use that. Just use that. Then after I go back in with my moisturizer, I just threw it. Anyways, I go back in with the moisturizer, that, and then I brush my hair. I go in with the moisturizer, and then after that, this is the second to last product that I use. Now you're all probably like, that is so much that you're using on your face, but it's not every, like, I don't do it all at once every time. And then lastly, I go in with the Mario Badescu Rose Water Facial Spray with Aloe Herbs and Rose Water. This online on at Urban 
is $12. This is the 8 ounce bottle. You can literally get it for $12. Anyway, that's how much I get it out of Amazon. It's just wherever. It's $12. So, I really recommend this. I think it actually, it really helps with my skin to clear it up. It smells good. If you don't like to smell a rose, then I don't know how to help you. <laughs> but there's, they also have like cucumber, I think. You, it doesn't have to be this one, but I know that rose really helps with clearing up acne. And this made it so much better. I do it, um, I spray it on after I do the toner and the moisturizer. And then after I do my makeup to set my makeup. It's just really good all around. So I really really recommend this just in general and this actually lasts me quite a while like it's my second bottle of this and I think the first time I bought this was maybe I don't even know I'll have to go back through my Amazon order thing but it's gotta been like I, I was already using it by last February but this February, whatever, whatever one just passed, but I've gone through like two bottles, almost two bottles in the past almost a year. So it does last a while, and it's only $12, so you know, depending how much you use it, how much you use, whatever. I use it twice a day, so there's that. And then the last thing, this is my spot treatment. You're all going to think it's a little weird, but it works. It really does work. It is... I don't know how many of you like have heard of using it, but it's fixed vapor rub. You put it on your spots and it draws out everything going on. Like I don't I get like random like oil zits, I think it's called. Like this one right here. It was hurting and it was a lot worse. And now look at it. I put this on it. So and these were all a lot worse and I put this on there. And you can get this at Target for four ninety nine. You can get this pretty much anywhere. It's for. It's actually a cough suppressant. Mine looks nasty because it's everyone's in the houses, but yeah, it just looks like that. And it works so well. Like I recommend using it. I might even like like I probably use this face mask. I because I don't do face masks really. Cause I'm scared it'll make me break out more because it like it's bringing out everything that's underneath the skin and like treating it right away. So yeah, so there's this for four ninety nine. Really recommend buying yourself a jar of Vicks Vapor Rub. Really good. So now on to what I was doing to get rid of my acne at first. So my mom is an esthetician. She has her license. Well, she did. I don't know if she she never renewed it. <laughs> But she was able to go to like Salon Tantric and places like that and buy like the heavy duty skincare stuff. So she was doing chemical peels on me and I, I stopped doing those because like they did, they were helping me clear up my acne. But I feel like if you use a lot of these products you're going to be able to clear up your acne or at least kind of help it along to clear up my acne. Um, before I had really bad acne like it was all, you can go through my old videos and you can see how bad it was like it was all right here it was really bad um chemical peels did kind of help like they were helping me but they made my skin really dry like all around like my face was flaky and i thought it was like i had um and like i was using foundations for acne and stuff and like it was just a lot like and then the, the chemical peel was just making me flaky it was gross. Like I didn't, I didn't like it. And then it was making me break out more because what it does, it's bringing out everything that's underneath. So that goes away. So then, like later on, it's not coming back. It just pulls it all out, and then you know, it's rid of it. So there's that, by the way. Like if you go do anything for acne, like facials, anything for, if you're like going for a big event, go at least like a month in advance or something like that. I think. Give it some time so it brings out everything and then clears it up. So, there's that. Um, but so chemical peels kind of helped. But then, like, I didn't want to do them anymore because I was like, I'm not... Like, my, it took my face so long. And I do them once a week. Don't do them more than a week. Or more than once a week because you're going to mess up your face. So, 
just letting you know but <laughs> so um, I did that and then I was you know I'm still using all of this like these three things and a moisturizer so there's that so I, I think they did help but I didn't and my face would get used to it, but then I would stop for a week or two, and then it would go back to being really flaky and nasty right after. So I wasn't enjoying that. <coughs> so I stopped doing those, so. Here's my skin now. I haven't done one in, like, almost a year. So. You know, my skin's doing good without them. So again, if you want to see, I don't have any, like, pictures saved on my phone with my acne. But if you want to see that going, like, back, like, past videos and you'll be able to see it. Uh, I know, I think my power of makeup video definitely can see it because it's like, it was so bad it looked like I had a contour on and I didn't. <laughs> so, drink water too. I mean, everyone knows that, but drink water. And I think that's actually all I have. Another thing, beauty blenders. I use beauty blenders a lot. I make sure to switch them out because I know that's probably also a big part of acne. So, make sure you take care of that because you do not want to be breaking out because of a beauty blender and wash your brushes, do all that, no it's a hassle. I don't do that often like I should, but, and give your skin, try to give your skin a few days break from wearing makeup. Sometimes I don't wear like any foundation or anything to school, one because I'm lazy, no really just because I'm lazy, but it does help just letting you know. So, I think that's pretty much it for all of my skincare routine. If you guys have questions about it, leave it down below so, so that I can, you know, answer it in the comments. Sorry, there's noises going on. Good thing I'm ending this video soon. So, there's all of that. Um, I made a second channel, by the way, it's going to be for all of the non-beauty related things, like if I do challenges, if I do vlogging, all that stuff. So I will link that down below for you guys to go subscribe or if you go into my channels, like tab in my, on my channel, like my main channel, then you'll find it there so then I can link it and uh, I'm hoping for that to be, you know, I'm hoping for it to work out because I'm gonna do like gaming videos. If I can download a screen capture thing on my computer, uh, vlogs, challenges, hauls that have nothing to do with makeup, just anything like that. So make sure you go subscribe over there. I'll be trying to upload soon on that. And I think no, that's actually it. That is it. Just so comment down below if you have any questions about anything, and I'll try and help you. And that's it. Bye guys, love you. Bathroom stalls for the powder nose.